I'm Casey Donovan, together with Amy Malloy. Thank you for joining us once again in the space, a mindfulness podcast that's not like the others. Every Monday, our theme is Let's Do This. Mindfulness tips to get clear for the week ahead. Do you ever feel emotionally hijacked by a situation or a conversation? You're going about your business feeling stable, calm and logical. You get triggered and bam! All your self-awareness goes out the nearest window. It happens to people every week, every day. You're chatting to your partner. They say one badly worded comment. Suddenly you're thrown into an irrational tailspin. Why are we even together? You're sitting in a cafe. The person at the next table throws you a funny look. You're overwhelmed with shame and anger. You don't even stop to question what's behind it. Perhaps they're just looking out the window. You're straight into fight or flight mode. Ready to attack or run. Ready to meet your attacker. It's called the amygdala hijack. The amygdala is a collection of cells at the base of your brain. It's key to how you process strong emotions like fear and pleasure. When stress makes you feel strong anger, aggression or fear, the fight or flight response is activated. It often results in a sudden illogical and irrational overreaction to a situation. Sound familiar? The good news is you can abort an amygdala hijack. This is according to Daniel Goleman, author of the book Emotional Intelligence, who shared a tip on the Armchair Expert podcast. The trick is used by Navy SEALs before operations. He also teaches it to frontline medical workers. When you feel emotionally triggered, stop and try this. Take a very deep breath so your belly expands. Hold it as long as comfortable. Then exhale slowly. Do this six to nine times, says Daniel. The research shows you shift from a fight or flight response to a recovery and relaxation state. It's something you can do on the spot. It won't change the situation, but it can change how you react to it. Isn't it weird to stop and breathe deeply during an argument? It's better than having to apologise later. Try it now. Never regret it. I'm Casey Donovan and you've been listening to The Space. We're back tomorrow with another mood-boosting episode. How to creatively flow without overflowing. Space out.